Welcome to clickmyproject.com. Let me discuss the project about analysis of CT and MRI image fusion using wavelet transform. In this paper, we propose a medical image fusion has been used to derive useful information from multimodality medical image data. The idea is to improve the image content by fusing images like computer demography and magnetic resonance imaging images so as to provide more information to the doctor and clinical treatment planning system. This paper aims to demonstrate the application of wavelet transformation to multimodality medical image fusion. This work covers the selection of wavelet function, the use of wavelet based function algorithms on medical image fusion of CT and MRI, implementation of fusion rules and the fusion image quality evaluation. The fusion performance is evaluated on the basics of the root mean square error and the peak signal to noise ratio. It's the black diagram of our project. First, we will load the input image for MRI and then next input image for CT. The next pre-processing will be fine for input images MRI and CT images. The next DWT is applied to pre-processed images in DWT is discrete wavelet transform. DWT is the will be applied for uh, pre-processing images. And, and a yeah, discrete wavelet transform is any wavelet transform for which the wavelets are discriminately sampled as with other wavelet transformations a key advantages it has over Fourier transforms is temporal resolution it captures both frequency and location information with the discrete wavelet transform has the hook number of applications in science engineering mathematics and computer science then in digital communications and many others it shows the most commonly used set of discrete wavelet transformations the next one is fusion. Fusion is the because the image fusion is the process to select the useful information from different sources. So the quality of the source images has the critical role on the fusion. In this project, we will enhance the source images before fusion. The source images would be enhanced through the wavelet transformation. The next one is inverse discrete wavelet transform. The clarity based selection algorithm can be used to fuse the high frequency coefficients obtained from our source images under the high frequency enhanced coefficients. The flow frequency obtained from the source images under the low frequency the enhanced coefficients can be fused in terms of weighted fusion algorithms. Then finally output images. The reconstruct the high frequency coefficients and low frequency coefficients obtained and get the fused images. Now let's see about the execution part. I am having main.m file. Select the file, right click run file fusion using hair wavelet then select image for CT here we have to select the input images in CT and then next here we have to select the input images for MRI the next pre-processing pre-processing will be find for input images CT and MRI images the next transformation for wavelet transformation in CT and MRI the discrete wavelet transform which applies a two channel filter bank with down sampling iteratively to the low pass band initially the original signal the wavelet representation then consists of the low pass band at the lowest resolution under the high pass bands obtained at each step this transformation is invisible and non redundant the DWT is a spatial frequency decomposition that provides a flexible multi resolution analysis of an image the next one is higher levels wavelet for level Four and level eight. This one is level four. Level four is the hair wavelet transformation it has gained woods bright acceptance in signal processing and image compression. Because of their inherent multi-resolution nature, wavelet coding schemes are especially suitable for applications where scalability and tolerable decoration are important. Then Next one is, hair wavelets are the fastest to compute and simplest to implement. Other types of wavelets might give better results but a higher cost perform a standard 2D hair wavelet decomposition of every image in the database. The next one is PCA based fusion coefficients. The next one is fusion. Fusion is principal component analysis is carried out which aims at reducing a large set of variables to a small set of that still containing most of the information that was available in the large set. The technique of principal component analysis enables us to create and use a reduced set of variables which are called principal factors. A reduced set is much easier to analyze and interpret. Then 
Next one is fusion weighted algorithm sir. Common way to find the principal component of a data set is by calculating the eigenvectors of the data covariance matrix. These eigenvectors give the directions in which the data distribution is structured must. Then next one is analysis process. Then comparison of CT, MRI and fused images. This analysis process is the used to the input can be reconstructed with the inverse discrete wavelet transformation. This process is the corresponding eigenvalues given an induction of the amount of information that the respective principal components representation. The principal components corresponding to large eigenvalues represent a large amount of information in the data set. And this tells us much about the relations between the data points. Then the, the experimental results demonstrate that the proposed fusion rule is effective when compared with the conventional fusion algorithms. Our proposed framework has introduced a recomposition stage to bridge two well established multi resolution technologies the wavelet representation and image fusion. And the applications for the widely used in medicine, remote sensing, computer vision, industrial and military aspects. Thank you.